Okay, we're going to do a quick demonstration on our 204B at TriTool Technologies. We have two different versions here today. We have a pneumatic version. We also have the electric 110, which also comes in 220. Uh, today we're going to do a 37 and a half degree bevel on this heavy wall 625 Inconel. And then also we'll go ahead and do a schedule 40 carbon cut. This machine's capable of going to an inch and a quarter with this mandrel that's in it, all the way up to four inch pipe. It's got a four inch cutting head. If you had a radial constraint problem, we do have the smaller head for clearance reasons. It also has a, options of having these other two mandrels, and this will get you all the way down to a 610 ID mounting. Okay, we're gonna get ready to cut this piece of heavy wall ink and L. 625 here with Tritool Technologies 204B. Uh, when you go ahead and want to set up your ramps for the ID size, you just measure your ID on a pipe. You come to the jaw block and ramp page in the manual, find your size range, and then come across and everything has the part numbers on there. And on the sides of the jaw blocks, it has the part numbers there. Okay, we're going to go ahead and mount this 204B beveler in the ink and L pipe right here. Only takes a 916 to tighten up your draw rod. You want to wiggle it around a little bit for your self centering, self squaring mandrel. Talk a little bit about the safety aspects of this machine. We have a dead man switch and a throttle control. So the dead the switch to actuate the machine can't be pulled on without disengaging the dead man switch. And you have a throttle control here for your RPM control. Once we get ready to cut, we will be removing our gloves because of rotating equipment. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and put our 37 and a half degree bevel on this piece of ink and L. Uh, we are going to use a little bit of water-soluble coolant to extend the tool bit life. We put a 37 and a half degree and it's got a little land on there. We'll get a close up here in a minute and show you the end result. Okay, we'll go ahead and remove the 204B. We'll look at some of the chips that came off this Inc. and L 625. Machine had no problem cutting it. We also want to look at our surface finish that we got. And you can go on Tritool's website and request a live demo.